move these wires out of the way. Now we're going to deal with these wires here. And I'm just going to work on the white wires, okay? We do this one step at a time. Usually I work with the ground wires first. Then I'm going to work with the white wires, okay? Get those situated to where these are the next three I'm going to work with. Just got the black wires pushed out of my way. Got the ground wire over here. Okay, we got the three wires here. Now, these are your neutral wires, and we've got one screw here. And we're going to attach it to the to the side of the screw. Okay, so what we got to do is we got to connect these three together in the box, and we've got to have one wire as a pigtail coming out of here. All right, so we got to do this a little bit different. We're going to have to put a wire nut on there, right? So we're going to put a wire nut on these three with the other one coming out. Just follow me. And then uh, we're going to hook it on the back side of here. All right, because all these white wires right now, we got to connect all those together no matter what. The black ones, I'll explain those later, okay? But for now, we got to connect all these up and we got one pigtail coming out of the wall. That's our next little step we got to do. Because this one's a short one, I've got to make these other two the same length, right? And so I got to hold those up there. I'm going to cut those off about the same length. Cut the tip of that off a little better. Okay, that looks pretty good. I want to get them too much shorter than that. That's pretty short. But I had to do that because this existing one was short. I don't want to, I can't do anything else. Okay, so that's that's the first thing you got to do. Now we got to come up with a pigtail. See, we're going to take a, here's, here's a little piece I cut off, but I'm not going to use this one because this one's kind of short. I've got some extra wire here and it's always good to have some extra wire with you to make little stubbies like this so that you can use, uh, use them for pigtails and stuff like that. Now usually on your job, you know, you're going to have little pieces of wire like this so you can cut that, strip that back off and uh, now you've got a, a piece a, a ground wire, a black wire and a white wire that you can use. You cut this off about from there that way. But I'm not going to do that because I happen to have some little separate pieces. Whenever I get ready to do this, I carry some of these with me. And um, I'm going to use this long piece here because it's all set up. That way, you know, I might have a project where I need one last little piece. Because see, like this, that's enough for, for uh, a whole run right there in my next project or whatever I'm doing. So I like to try to keep my small little pieces of wire for something else, okay? So now I'm going to use this, and uh, I don't need it this long, so I'll cut that. See this here is probably long enough for two, so I'll just kind of check out that. I got enough for two pigtails for later. I'm going to use one now though. Okay, so I'm going to take this. I've got to strip it, and I'm going to bend the end over like that, and I'm going to hold these four all together, make that bend a little bit longer, something like that, and then I'll hold that up there, hold it all together, and put a wire nut on there, okay? So the next thing we got to do is strip these wires back. Do you know how to strip wire? My wire strippers, um, there's different little marks here and you look for the coordinating one and each one's got a little number next to it and you look at that I see where 12 is it's the second it's not the biggest hole it's the next one up so that's 12 gauge wire so I just take that see not on that end one because that's too big the next one and then I want to make about a half inch or so put that on there and push it and kind of twist it off and pull. Okay, now I can kind of look at that and see how long those are. Those, that looks pretty good right there. See that? 
Okay, then I take my, my other little piece here, and I can do that to that one too. Twist it and, you know, pinch it and then kind of twist it a little bit like that, okay? Got that tip slightly bent on that, so I want to make that kind of straight if I can. Okay, so now I can kind of bend that like that because I just want to hold it all together. Just want to trial run here to see what I have to do holding those up there because so I have to get all these together, and if I have to, I may have to. Uh, Reposition one of those, rebend the tip, whatever, because I got to get them all in a bunch, and that looks pretty good. See? Okay, now I'm ready for the wire nut. <laughs> 